to me, this where you draw, where you draw to is not an anchor. I can't consider that as an anchor because it's too many different places. Well, isn't that an anchor when you put it different places? Well, no, it's a reference to your eye for the back of that arrow. That's what the brain is looking for. The brain is looking for a reference and so forth. So when you draw back, I don't care whether you're drawing here, now you've, that's a reference to the eye. The back of this arrow is reference to the eye. Put it here, you're still, you're putting it here for a reference for the eye. So the eye can go to work and look, know what you want, look and can see this line, this arrow for that. It's a reference. If you go to three fingers under, it's still a reference. It's still a reference. What are you anchoring? You're anchoring the shoulder blade. That's your anchor. When you come back in here, I don't care what position you want, you get back in here, boom. You anchor the shoulder, now you're using your back. You anchor the shoulder blade at your aiming reference. You anchor the shoulder blade at your aiming reference. So I'll do it from the back side. When you come back here, the spread, boom, boom, there. See how this throw? Boom, there it is. You anchor your shoulder blade. That's your anchor, there's your anchor. Right there's your anchor. If you're gonna be up in here floating like this, you're out and then you got all kinds of movement. Anchor it so it's solid, so it's firm. Also, don't be afraid to press, press in to your aiming reference if you're gonna be off the side, press into it. And the reason being that if you press into it, it just firms up your, press into it. Don't be out here floating because then your eye doesn't know what the hell it's supposed to do. You press into it, get it solid. Pull into it, get it solid. Then you anchor.